Hello everybody, we're back again to renumber some retired coats. This time we're going to be playing around in my less than 100 use retired coats. These are just the creation space coats. These don't include my pre-CS coats because I do have quite a few pre-CS coats that are less than 100 copies. So that's just these horses here. There's something around 59, 60 horses. Last time we took a look at renumbering all of my retired coats that had Helios rays on them. They had backgrounds with them. I had some really positive feedback on that video. Some people had asked me to go through do go through some of my other retired coat farms or even just golden apple farms or uh, talk about some of my favorite horses on the game. So that definitely gives me some ideas for some videos I can do in the future and I'll look at putting some of that stuff together, especially for my favorite horses and favorite coats or creations. Uh, there's a lot that I can talk about there. I'm not sure if I'll put all of those into one video and just do like a top three for each category or if I wanted to get a little bit more detailed and extensive I could probably do a whole video just for each category and then I could do like a top five or Maybe, maybe even a top 10, but I think I might just do a top five or something. I don't know. We'll see. Today, we're just going to renumber some more coats because I'm almost done. This is the second to the last farm I have to do. So let's go look at these. Because these are less than 100 copies, I think I might have said uses earlier, but they're, they probably are less, like, they were limited to 100 uses, and that's why they dropped down to below 100 copies now but some of these do have backgrounds on them, so that'll be interesting. Like this one here, I did buy the coat, but I put this background on it because it came with a different background. This one has 88 copies now. This didn't drop too many. Let's go. This one's quite pretty. It's very interesting. Like how sparkly it is. This one here, this one has its own name. It like the horse has its own name. Flitter Patch is not the name of the of the coat because this one was part of a unicorn breeding project that I have. This one, I love this one. I did, I applied both the coat and the background to it. This has 92 copies now. It did drop a little bit, but not too much. Some of these drop quite a bit. The 100 uses, they'll drop quite a bit and some of them won't drop much. This one only dropped one copy. I have no idea how old this coat is or if I was the one that applied it. I'm pretty sure most of these I did apply. 95 for this one. I do believe this is a, is this a Kapima, who I think is now called Karma. This is another one of my favorite creators. I really like their style. Yeah, this is a Karma coat. I love it because the style across all of their coats is really similar. They're just, they're really cute. And I love this one too. This one's really adorable. I thought I had a background applied to it, but apparently I definitely don't. So I don't know what happened there. 97 copies for this one. I did apply this coat. I'm guessing most of these are coats that I applied, like that one I think I applied it. Well, this one I definitely applied it because this is one of my own horses, like that I bred. I'm not quite finishing out my thoughts and my sentences. <laughs> All right. Okay. Draft in the sky. This one I definitely applied. This is the very first wing draft coat. Draft wing, the very first wing draft coat. I can't talk today either. This one, I applied both the background and the coat for this one. This one only dropped one copy. Yes. Just want to make sure I did write that correctly. I love this one. The colors in it are gorgeous. It took me a while to find a background that I thought would work with it. And I paired the coat with this background because I just thought the colors just paired very well with the coat. Count Donkula, this one I definitely, yeah, I'm, I'm guessing most of the coats that are in here I applied thanks to when I finally became VIP a few years ago and I got the uh, early release perk so that I can buy limited coats 12 hours before the original release because I could never get coats during the regular release and I don't feel like getting up that early anyway, except for this one. This one, I do remember that I bought this one. That one's really pretty. This one's beautiful too. Is this a Lissy coat? Yeah, it is. That one's really pretty. I like this. It's an Appaloosa, so of course I like it. 68 copies. This one dropped a lot. Oh my goodness. I haven't seen too many limited limited use coats that drop that much. This one's gorgeous. I think this one's a pretty new one, like just within the last like two releases or something. This is another Karma coat, 91. I have almost all of their coats. There's like one or two. There aren't very many that I'm missing from Karma's. I really, I just, I really like their coats. Fly to the sky, 90. I did apply this one. I need a space there. It really drives me crazy if I don't have a space. It just 
looks it just doesn't look good <laughs> I, w I want a space in the name but sometimes there's just too many characters and it just like the character limit for the naming box just does not allow for a space so just have to deal with it 100 this one needs a background eventually i'll have to try to remember that because apparently i really wish there was a breeding farm search that you could search for horses with helios rays but doesn't actually have a background applied because there is currently no search for that and there are some horses i know scattered in my farms that have a helios ray but i never actually put a background on them and that's likely because they have a harmony pack because i don't think there's any other way that it could have the Helios Ray, but not the background. 95 for this one. That one doesn't have to change at all. That one's really cute. 97, 96. I like this one. This one's so cool. It reminds me of like a video game or something because there's just so much going on with it. Like the Rainbow Road. There's like a pizza and a cat with wings. I like this coat. That one's so cool. All right. 100 for this one. That one does not change. Looks like most of these are not going to change. This one, I really like this one. I did apply both the background and the coat to this. I'm not even sure how I managed to find that I just stumbled on it one day. I was searching for backgrounds with blue in them. If you're curious, if you, if you end up getting this coat and you'd like to get this background for it, the background is called Blue Planet. So the background is active. You can definitely get this background. 91 copies. I only dropped one. The only bad part I think about this pairing is that the coat is quite dark and the blue of the background is quite dark so the horse doesn't pop too much but the blue of it definitely pops and this little like if you look at the actual coat for the horse if I click on the correct golden apple icon if you look at the coat for the horse that blue uh, crystal thing that's part of the horse it's not part of the background so I was really happy when I found this background it's like it was made for the coat this one I bought the coat the horse but I applied the background 90 for this one I think there's another version of this like something similar maybe this is another karma coat I really love karmas 89 and I feel like most of their coats definitely the ones in here that shows there are a lot that are limited to 100 uses and I had not had them at the time they retired so I had to go in the sales and buy them myself which some of them were quite expensive this one here is another unicorn 89 copies Let's change that to 89. Love is blue. That one's pretty. This one, I really like this one. This is nice. See, this is another one that has a Helios Ray, but I haven't actually applied the background to it yet. Ooh, this one's pretty. This one's pretty new too. I just applied this not too long ago. 99 copies. And I have a lot of Helios Rays stocked up. So eventually I'll go through my retired coat collection and I'll start applying rays to them because oh, you could get really creative with pairing rays and coats. Oh, this one's pretty. I think this one I actually bought out of the sales. I didn't apply the coat. 77. That one does not change. This one's pretty too. I really like the colors in this one. 96. That one does not change. That one I applied the coat. This one I got... Uh, a player was very kind enough to sell it to me for very cheap, 92, but I'm not going to put the number on that. This is another Karma Coat, 87. I think this was like the most recent one that I bought. Got a pretty, this is probably a draft horse. Yep, this is a draft horse, 100. That one doesn't need to change. 86 for this one. That one does not change either. See, that one you could pair with some really pretty backgrounds. Marari Angel, that one's pretty. 89. I think I applied this one and it wasn't too long ago. This one I bought out of the sales. I love the detail of this coat because it's sort of, it's definitely what you would like if you were collecting model horses, it would be a decorator. But even with like the unrealistic colors for an actual horse, the actual application of it just looks really realistic because you can see the pinking here and like all the areas where a paint horse would have pinking. You can see just a little bit of pink on the muzzle. You'd have to almost zoom in to see it. There's just so much detail to this coat. I really like this one. 78, but we don't change the copies for it. 76, this one. I love this one too. I like the fairy magic kind of coats. That one dropped one copy. I don't know if I applied the background to it and I'm kind of wondering if maybe I should change it. I don't know that the coat itself says winter like the background does. I might go and change that. I'm not sure. 88 copies. That one does not change. That's a cute little unicorn. Ooh, this one. I really like this one. I don't know if I 
I think I bought it as is. I didn't apply the background to it. 88, that one, um, I think I just decided to leave the name because of the Paul's Lear. I quite like that. This is another Karma Coat. 91 copies for this one. So we have to change that one and go down to one. There we go. 94, this is another Karma Coat. This one, I do believe I applied it myself. I didn't buy this one. 92. Yeah, if I do, if I say I bought the coat, I mean that I bought the horse with the coat already applied. And then if I actually applied it myself with the GA, technically I did buy the coat because I bought it with the GA, but I'm going to say that I applied the coat myself. 90. I really like this one too. This one was on my most wanted list for quite a while. I just love this. This is beautiful. The detail with the stripes on it and then the mane and the tail. I love this one. I think this creator has another coat that's fairly similar. Or maybe there's just another coat that's similar to this, but it's not by the same creator. I'm going to have to go through my farm to see what that coat is because I can't quite recall. I might not even, I, it's possible that I don't own it either. 98. It's, after a while, there are some coats that you've wanted for a really long time and you haven't managed to get them. And then you just think, like your brain seems to think that you own it and you really don't. This coat, I love this one. This is, I think I, when I bought it, I posted it in the Retired Coat Gallery and I just said this was the most happy coat I have ever seen. The expression on this little pony's face is just absolutely adorable. I was just really happy when I bought it just because the expression on the coat. That was really cool. 78 for this one. This one's really pretty. 76 now. That's beautiful. I love this coat. It's so pretty. A lot of detail to it. This one I bought. This was my very first draft horse coat. I bought it just to collect my, or I bought it just to finish one of my trophies because you have to have a golden apple or retired coat per species or something. So I bought that before I actually started collecting retired coats. It's thanks to the trophy collection that I started retire or collecting retired coats because I started getting the coats, like I said, to finish off my trophies. And then I just liked buying them and the process of hunting down coats that I really liked. This is another Karma coat. So I just decided to start collecting coats. And I didn't have anything else to spend my money on at the time. So I figured I might as well uh, spend my money on retired coats. Why not? Oh, this one's really cute, too. I love this coat. This is just so adorable. My Lady Carmen 89. That one does not change at all. 97. This one's really pretty, too. I need to put a background with this one. This one just screams, give me a background. I could go with a lot of different things. 86. I think this is another Karma coat, is it? Yeah. I couldn't quite tell. I just wanted to be sure. 85. I don't know if I applied the background to it. I don't even remember if I actually applied the coat myself. I might have bought it as is. This one, oh, this one was uh, is by the same creator as one of the first couple horses that we looked at. 88. So that one doesn't change. You can, the, the style is quite similar. I really like both of them. They're really pretty. 88 for this one. Oh, I like this one too. Look at the wings. There's so much color. How, oh, what was that? 80, 88. So the number of copies went up. Or it's possible the last time I went through and I renumbered them that I renumbered it incorrectly. White Orchid. 82. Is this a fray coat? Yes, it is. I couldn't quite tell. 82. I want to make sure. 82. There we go. That one's changed. Ooh, I really like this one. I like the wings. I like when Pegasus wings almost look like owl wings. I have quite a few coats that are like that. 86. Just because of like the colors and how the feathers look, it just reminds me of an owl's wings. 95 for this one. That one's cute. I really like this one. 91. Normally, I wouldn't consider myself a person that's into kind of sparkles. I don't think these are sparkles. They look like little flower petals. But for some reason, when it comes to golden apple coats on horse, I love sparkles. <laughs> I don't know why. 95. That one doesn't change. Ooh, I really like this one. 95 for this one. 91 now. Uh, this one, I do believe I applied both the coat and the background. I'm not quite sure. 
And it looks like that's it for that farm. So that one went quite quick, probably because I wasn't getting distracted by all the backgrounds because there weren't that many backgrounds in this particular farm. So that's it for this farm. I'm definitely going to look at the last farm I have to renumber, which should be this one here, which are my retired coats. And then I'll have to go through and renumber all of those too. So stay tuned for that one. Stay tuned for my favorite coats, favorite horses. Maybe I'll do like favorite divines too. I have quite a few ideas of different things I can do because there's a lot of horses that I have. So I'd almost have to come up with extra categories just so I can talk about all of my favorite coats. Thank you guys for joining me today. Hope you enjoyed looking at some more retired coats and I will talk to you soon. Bye.